They come in all sizes, shapes, and colors, and they're humans' best friends. Over centuries, various dog breeds across the globe have been trained by humans to play important roles, from hunter to guardian, from herder to companion. For some of these breeds, size has been of significant importance, whether that was to hunt bigger game, or guard a home with more authority, or even just to have the mass to survive in freezing climates. But of all the dog breeds in the world, who are the biggest? Let's find out. Welcome to another episode of Forever Green. Today, we're counting down the top 10 biggest dogs in the world. If you thought Great Danes were the tallest dogs, then be sure to stick around for number one, because this lesser known breed is even taller. Number 11, Bully Kuda. This massive dog is known as Bully Kuda, or Pakistani Mastiff, and is a direct descendant of the Alant, an ancient breed of large, short-coated hunting dogs bred to hunt and fight alongside horses and defend their master's campsites. Some rare samples of Bully Kuta have reached 200 pounds and can stand as much as 44 inches tall. And if well exercised, they can pack on a serious amount of muscle. Although they're no longer used in battle, Bully Kudas still aren't that friendly, which is actually their main selling point. If you're in need of a guard dog, Bully Kudas are perfect because they get along with the humans they respect, but will attack other animals and strangers. Number 10. French Mastiff You may recognize this iconic mug as the Dog de Bordeaux, more commonly known as the French Mastiff. They also go by several other names, such as the Bordeaux Mastiff and Bordeaux Dog, no matter what you choose to call them. This breed stands a massive 27 inches tall and weighs up to 150 pounds. And although other French breeds like the Poodle, the Basset Hound, and the French Bulldog are the more famous French breeds, the Mastiff is one of the most ancient breeds of the country. Although its face may look intimidating, this powerful dog is amazingly loyal and affectionate. Back in the days, they were a jack of all trades used for anything from guarding the house to watching over flocks and even pulling carts. Nowadays, they're still very active outdoors, but make for a gentle and mellow family companion when indoors. Number 9. Newfoundland The Newfoundland is a big-boned, muscular working dog that's also a powerful swimmer and a great water rescue dog. Unlike several larger breeds, the Newfoundland wasn't bred to become a guard dog. Instead, their original purpose was to help fishermen haul nets and lines from boats, pull carts, and, most importantly, fetch anything that falls overboard including people. Yup, that's how big and muscular these guys are. In fact, there have been many rescues of people out at sea credited to these big, owner-orientated dogs. They may not look it, but Newfoundlands stand between 27 to 30 inches tall, which is about as tall as the average Great Dane. They also weigh an incredible 150 pounds, which is about as much as the average human. And they look even bigger because of their thick double coat, which keeps them warm even in icy water. Number 8. St. Bernard If you can't get your hands on a Newfoundland, then St. Bernards are yet another breed of big, fluffy, easy-going companions to look out for. Originally created in the Swiss Alps and Northern Italy as a rescue dog, the St. Bernard is a massive, friendly, ever-drooling affection machine that stands up to 35 inches in height and is also one of the heaviest dogs in the world, averaging about 200 pounds. Some of these guys have even been known to reach a weight of up to 260 pounds. The monks of the St. Bernard Hospice are the ones credited with training dogs for rescue and for playing a role in developing the breed as we know it today. 
However, today's St. Bernards are mostly family dogs, and they're most famous for being gentle, loving, friendly dogs that are great with families and children. Apparently, they're great with kittens, too. Number 7. Leonberger If you thought the massive Leonberger looks like a cross between a Newfoundland and a St. Bernard, that's because it is. In the mid-1840s, Heinrich Essig of Leonberg, Germany, crossed a Newfoundland with a St. Bernard for four generations, then added a Pyrenean mountain dog into the mix, finally resulting in what's known as the Leonberger. Similar to their forefathers, these guys can weigh as much as 200 pounds and stand an incredible 31 inches tall. Although they were bred as a companion animal, like the St. Bernard and the Newfoundland, Leonbergers do very well in everything from water rescue to tracking to herding. If there is an activity that requires both strength and brain, the Leonberger is probably going to be good at it. But really, they're just one giant family dog breed. Before we move on to our next massive hound, here's a quick challenge for you. If you can leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and turn on the notifications in less than 5 seconds, you will have 10 years of amazing luck. Hurry up and try it. It actually works. Number 6. English Mastiff Growing up to a height of 30 inches and weighing in at as much as 250 pounds, the English Mastiff is considered one of the largest dog breeds in the world. As you know, a Great Dane holds the record for tallest dog, but an English Mastiff holds the record for being the heaviest. The biggest weight for a dog ever recorded was an English Mastiff named Akema Zorba, who weighed in at an incredible 343 pounds, about twice as much as the average human. Hand in hand, with their size also comes bravery, which is a significant part of the breed's past purpose. In the past, English Mastiffs participated in all kinds of blood sports, such as baiting bears, bulls, and even lions. Nowadays, their courage and fearlessness sit on the back burner while their more gentle, even-tempered loyal sides come forward in their roles as family dogs. So, if your kids are asking for a gentle dog and you're looking for someone big enough to scare off intruders, this breed should be your first choice. Number 5. Neapolitan Mastiff This breed comes in several colors, including black, blue, mahogany, and tawny. By now, you'll probably have noticed that Mastiff breeds are some of the largest in terms of sheer mass, used mostly as a guard dog. The average male Neapolitan Mastiff stands around 30 inches tall. It can weigh up to a hefty 155 pounds while females are usually a little smaller, standing a few inches shorter and weighing 110 to 130 pounds. The Neapolitan Mastiff originated in southern Italy and is known for being fearlessly protective of their home and family, making it an ideal guard dog, but not quite the best warning system. You see, Neapolitan Mastiffs are more known for quietly sneaking up on intruders rather than barking to warn them off. Case in point, you certainly don't want to stand between a Neapolitan Mastiff and its family, and if you're thinking of owning one, you'll need to put in some serious training time into your dog's socialization. Number 4. Scottish Deerhound Going back to the less bulky, more leggy breeds, the Scottish Deerhound gives away its whole purpose and origin with its name. Originating in Scotland, these guys were once used to hunt red deer and could easily chase down its prey with those long legs. Deerhounds will stand up to 32 inches tall and weigh as much as 110 pounds. And although they're not doing any deer hunting today, some enthusiasts still use them for show and in some places, lure coursing, a dog sport that involves chasing a mechanically operated lure. With a lanky body meant for speed, these guys are built similar to Greyhounds, who didn't make today's list because the Deerhound is far larger and heavier than its less hairy counterpart. 
Number 3. Caucasian Shepherd Traditionally used for herding livestock, the Caucasian Shepherd is a gorgeous Eastern European breed that's best reserved for experienced dog owners who excel in obedience and socialization. With great size comes great responsibility. And with an average height of 30 inches and a massive weight of up to 220 pounds, the Caucasian Shepherd is surely no easy walk in the park, literally. And not just due to their size, but also because this breed can have difficulty getting along with other dogs and get aggressive if threatened. But if you think you have what it takes to train and care for one of these beauties to become well socialized, you'll have a dog that can definitely keep you warm and safe at night. It is now time for today's subscriber pick. We asked our subscribers to send in their pictures for their friendliest animals, and today's thumbnail pick was sent to us by a subscriber wondering about this incredible picture, Great Dane. Number 2. Great Dane Though they aren't the heaviest dogs, Great Danes are among the tallest, often standing 28 to 30 inches tall, but often they can be even taller. The world record holder for tallest dog was a late Great Dane called Zeus, who stood an incredible 44 inches tall. Unfortunately, Great Danes trade longevity for their size and live only to be between 6 to 8 years old, which is peanuts compared to most breeds who live anywhere from 10 to 15 years. The Great Zeus died of old age at just 5 years old. The Great Dane is also known as the German Mastiff, but before setting down its official roots in Germany, the dog that eventually became known as the Great Dane breed actually came from a crossbreed between English Mastiffs and Irish Wolfhounds. And although it's typically considered the largest of all dog breeds, you're about to meet a few other breeds that give the Great Dane a serious run for its money. And if you stick around until number one, you'll meet a lesser known breed that is actually even taller. Number one, Irish Wolfhound. And finally, at the top of our list is a dog taller than most Great Danes. While the tallest dog in the world is in fact a Great Dane, with a standard of 35 inches tall, the Irish Wolfhound can often keep up with the average Great Dane and often even grow to be a lot taller. Yes, the Irish Wolfhound can basically grow to be as tall as a donkey. These brave dogs originated in Ireland, and contrary to popular belief, they were not crossbred with wolves. In fact, they were used for the purpose of wolf hunting. Even before then, they were used in war to drag men off horses and chariots. And although they may sound fierce, the breed has long since left those jobs in the past and adapt perfectly well to family living if properly socialized. And that's it for the top 10 biggest dogs in the world. Which one of these would you want to keep as a pet? Let us know in the comments below. And if you found this video interesting, you're going to love our video on 10 most expensive dog breeds in the world.